So we're looking forward to welcoming you back to Tavern Sick Form. Um, there's been a few differences in September as we use bubbles to try and keep the year groups apart. And just to reassure you what it's going to be like, I've got a short video to show you how it's going to work. Um, so the Sick Form will be using uh, a different entrance as they come into school. So we're going to be using the entrance here uh, by the uh, bike shed entrance. And we'll have our own dedicated doors. Um, so those are the ones that lead to the PE corridor. Of course, these will all be blocked open once you return. Um, and then once you go in, we have our own set of staircase stairs here at the back of the building. So the only staircase the sixth form will be using to go in and out, whether you're going to home study, whether you're going to your lessons, um, or whether you're going uh, in off site. Um, and we'll be moving hand sanitizer, electric hand sanitizer, you put your hands under and it gives you a squirt, and the registration system over to the centre of the building over the summer. All the sick form areas are still available to sick form. So um, as you can see, as we come up here, um, you'll still have access to the common room and the sick form study center. So if we have a look in here for the common room, it's more or less identical as before, except a few differences made. You can see one or two chairs have uh, crosses on to stop you being too close to each other. And parts of the desks are marked as um, not to be used as that means, again, people are too close. Um, again, Miss Higgsons will be based up here. We've moved Miss Green into a different office downstairs just to give a bit more social distancing and space. The only toilets you can use are the sick form toilets, which are going to be located up here. So, um, again, each part of the school has a different set of toilets. So, again, ours are located conveniently in our area. And if we come into the sick form study centre, again, it looks a bit more like normal. Um, a few minor changes. You can see we've moved the tables into rows to, again, create social distancing. And again, just meaning you're not facing each other and that reduces the risk within the bubble. Um, because the furniture is soft, we're going to have this area fogged, um, which means a kind of chemical chem um, sanitize, uh, sanitization process takes place to kind of make sure everything is nice and clean, the carpet, um, the computer keyboards, etc., to keep it all very uh, hygienic. And again, there'll be hand sanitizer and stuff based up here. My office is still up here, of course, over in the corner. Um, and again, your library and resources are all up here as well. Uh, for your use. Again, you've still got the suite of computers that you'll be able to use, um, and again, they're located behind me. And we've also improved and put new Wi Fi in the sick form, which means um, throughout the sick form area, common room and sick form study centre, if you bring your own laptop um, and you want to access learning that way, then you still can. Uh, of course, mobile phones still apply, so you can have your mobile phones in the sick form centre, and again, you can access the Wi Fi, you can listen to, to music if it helps you study, that sort of thing. Um, again, otherwise, apart from updating for next year with our new leadership team, um, otherwise things are pretty normal. The difference with the bubble is going to be that your learning areas are all going to be brought together. So they'll be all located conveniently near the sick form study centre. Um, so as we come out into this sort of upstairs area, which you can also um, move around in, we'll be using the classrooms located down the uh, immediate corridor. So we're going to be using F15, 14, 13, around the corner F1 and 2. And again, this means that your teachers will be coming to you, so rather than having, say, English in the English block, the English teacher will be coming to teach you English in one of these rooms. There are some specialist areas as well that Sixth Form will be using, so um, located around the site. So again, leaving via the PE corridor stairs, um, you'll be able to go out to S5 if you have science lessons and you need a lab, PA1 for music lessons and art lessons, and uh, over to D2 uh, for technology um, and product design lessons. So again, the specialist areas are still there for those who need them, uh, but there'll just be set routes to get there so you're not crossing and mixing with years uh, seven to 11. Um, so that's how the uh, site's gonna look. Um, again, it's a bit strange, but we want to return to normal as quickly as possible. Um, and again, if there's any relaxation or things improve, then we'll be able to do that. And uh, as you can see, um, we're really really um, keen to get back to normal and get you back here at Tavern Sick Form. So whether you're new into year 12 or a returning year 13 student, uh, again, you'll find a few extra procedures, reminders, you know, the catch it, bill it, kill it, for example. Every classroom and then of course the study centre as well has um, cleaning uh, materials so you can clean down keyboards and things. Uh, there is hand sanitizer uh, as you enter the building, like I mentioned earlier, but also in every room. So again, you've got all these kind of extra precautions that hopefully mean that when you do return to uh, Tavrum in the um, autumn, that you, we can keep you safe as possible and uh, make sure you can then get resume your learning. If there was uh, a spike in the bubble web, which means one or two people um, are tested for COVID and uh, found to have the, have the disease, um, then as a precautionary measure, the whole bubble will be shut down. So all of year 12 and 13 would go back home um, and study from there. And we return to what's called blended learning, where your learning would go back to being set or through sharing my homework and through webinars um, instead of at school. Again, hopefully we won't come to that, but that is a precaution that we've put in place. So hopefully um, that answers some of your questions and um, I hope you can have a relax and have a lovely summer um, and return ready to have a bit more of a normal, normal uh, education experience when you come back um, in the autumn. So have a great summer. I look forward to seeing you then. Take care.